Welcome back to my channel, we're looking at Chance Failed to prove his points about fair use. Last time we learned that he's pretty confused. Which really isn't a surprise, all things considered. Here's part 2 of his lesson on fair use and proving the trolls aren't abiding by it. Spoiler, he fails miserably. For a prime example, um, Bay Shaman. We all know he watches a lot of my videos. What he does can be considered fair use because he is transformative with the content. Now, if you go back... Well, there's good news. Did you hear that based shaman? Raxo thinks you're doing things right, and for once, he's actually correct. Now, if you go back to the original video here... Now, if you go back to, like, you know, the original video that I was just at, which is one of my own videos... Unofficial Cyrax Archives. Every video was 100% stolen by these people. Okay, Chance, but we need to actually see the video to know whether you're telling the truth. If they're loaded with commentary, critique, or other quote-unquote transformative aspects, then they are just fine. You have to actually show us Cyrax. Can't speak for anyone else, but I've seen you lie and simply get things wrong way too many times to trust you on word alone. Every person that has ever posted my videos, unless they are reacting, has stolen my work. Point in case. You mean case in point. Let's look for just a really short one here. Um, just browsing around, something that's short and easy, like Injustice 2 right here. Let's, let's, let's take a look at this just for prime example. There literally is no chance you're skipping through like the whole video. No commentary. How do we know there wasn't any commentary no, or criticism? No, no, what do the video notes video. say? Let's go here to videos. Just breezing through is not proof, you silly goose. And look, here's some that were fairly recent. Point in case. Start you mean cover, case in us. point from my original channel. <laughs> And let's go to another We saw four uh, seconds of the video uh, dummy How are we to know you didn't just pick four uh, seconds without commentary? Let's go here, car X drift From 12 days ago What is One of my videos Car X drift racing Mount Akina When I was doing the Manami uh, chaser when I, was doing Mount, when I was doing the Manami drift course And then I ripped it up on Mount Akina So, show us him stealing this the chaser and I did that video. These people are blatantly committing copyright infringement. They are not being transformative. But what they are doing is lying to YouTube, claiming that they are a archive channel. You can't tell that, that from a few a seconds and a paused image. To get away with stealing my content. These people have been doing this for many years now, and it needs to stop. So to the 28.3 auditorium and anybody else out there that is committing blatant copyright infringement by saying that I am a paid actor when I am not. I am not a paid actor. Everything I do is of my own doing. I am not a paid actor. Chance, no I almost me. hate to tell you this, no but that paid actor thing signed. looks like a red a herring. You're taking it way too seriously. It's false. It is Whether or not you were paid for your original work is irrelevant to copyright and fair use. You're almost literally Don Quixote chasing a windmill. Again, nobody is implying you signed away the rights to videos or anything like that. The sentence says that an actor was paid to be in these videos. It doesn't necessarily mean you. Point in case. You mean, case in point. Chance, do you realize you're looking for a contract referred to by the 283 Auditorium in N-Word Boys Community tab? Those are two different people, and neither said you specifically signed anything. No chance, those posts aren't stealing your work. They are bulletins and information about you and others he watches. His coverage of your videos no is not on the community tab. Still no contracts. 
He does all shit posting. As you can tell, shit posting and making it to where I can't do anything. There's more still, but it's pretty much the same thing. Chance saying stuff without showing anything to back his claims up. If he wasn't a simpleton, I think he was intentionally misunderstanding the situation. The truth is, he's just in way over his head. Thanks for checking this out and hopefully you found it as funny as I did. Have a great one.